There's a way you can make your cafe beautiful and profitable. In this Daily Espresso, I'm going to share with you how to achieve a winning layout that converts to more sales, more profit, and an increase in your cafe's value. Hi, I'm Nadia Elias, and this is The Daily Espresso. Now, when it comes to positioning your cafe, how you wow your customers when they walk through the door is of just as much importance as the physical location. To wow your customers time and time again, you need a beautiful, functional layout. This is what gets your customers talking and sharing on social media and bringing their friends along with them the next time they visit. The step to a winning cafe layout is finding the balance between beauty and functionality. The key though is how you find a happy medium between the art and science of your cafe's design to meet your customers' expectations and enhance the customer experience. Whilst there's no point in spending a million dollars on a fit out just to get people coming in to take photos of your cafe, you can't neglect the need to invest in the layout of your cafe to enhance the overall appeal. People eat with their eyes and setting the scene right from the second they walk in is paramount. But you can't stop there. You also need to focus on creating a functional layout that enhances a better workflow and more capacity. For example, increased seats in your cafe has more likelihood of increasing customer spending on food, which increases profitability if you get everything else right. However, creating a space which flows well from both the customer point of view, example, tables are cleared quickly and service is fast, allows you to turn over tables quicker, increase your cover count and your total sales. This is something you need to nail because you can't just squeeze in customers like sardines just to get more of them on the floor. Your layout must also allow you to promote your business while your customers are sitting in it. The biggest time to promote and sell to your customers is in the time it takes from your front of house team, sitting them down to taking their order. You wanna greet them fast, seat them fast, and quick flow means quick profit. And your entire layout should be visible to the customer. One open space works, multiple rooms create segregation, and you should keep this in mind if you're planning on setting up in an old heritage converted building. From what I know, cafe sales are increased when customers are able to have a full view of the barista, the kitchen, and the glorious food coming out of it. Even a hole in the wall to the kitchen can help do this, so take note. The thing is, people want more than just good coffee. Give them your vision through a beautiful design, and you're gonna get the payoff. The award-winning cafe High Ground in Melbourne is a perfect example of this. The investment they've put into creating something new and beautiful has translated into eyes on them and a constant stream of bums on seats. Being noted for the design is what got them awards and coverage from traditional media and social media. This success is what results in more sales, more cash, more profit and more value. And that's what you want. But whilst higher ground is a great example, you don't need to hit this level unless that's the market or vision you're chasing. Keep in mind who your target market is, the location you're in, the design according to that, and keep improving as you go. Now I'd love to hear how your location and your layout is working best or not so well for you. Hit me up in the comments, of course, share, like, subscribe, stay in touch. I'm Nadia Elias, this is The Daily Espresso, get cracking.